Yo, what's going on, and saw dudes? Welcome back to Black Ops 3, a year in review. This is the final episode in the series. We're going to be talking about the final verdict in Black Ops 3. Now, I have to mention that this episode is entirely opinionated. This is my opinions on how good I thought the game was. I'm not drawing from the community. I'm not any of that jazz. This is all my opinions, so if you disagree or if you agree, that's cool. You just let me know in the comments below. Just know that opinions are a thing. Everybody has one. Yours could be different than mine, so keep that in mind. But uh, yeah, so I don't even have a gameplay that I'm watching in the background right now because I have no idea how long I'm going to go for in terms of talking about this. This could be a minute long commentary. This could be a 10 minute long commentary. I guess we will see how things go. So the question is... Was Black Ops 3 a good game? How was it as a Call of Duty? Was it good for the franchise? And this, my answer is gonna, it's gonna make a lot of people mad, I think, because I, I think a lot of the majority of the players really want things to go back to boots on the ground and go back to how things were in Call of Duty before Black Ops 3, before Advanced Warfare. And, and I'll admit, I don't entirely disagree with that, but for me, Black Ops 3 is the best Call of Duty that has ever been made. And I know, that's a very, very bold statement, and it is a very subjective statement. So you got to keep that in mind. Again, like I said, these are opinions. So why is Black Ops 3 the best Call of Duty? Why did I like it so much? So I mentioned this in the good, that the game was very well balanced. And not only that, it's the most balanced Call of Duty to date. And you can't argue that, I don't think. I, I can't really think of any Call of Duty where the perks or and perks and the weapons, I should say. Both the perks and the weapons were so well balanced. Call of Duty 4 is one that people always cling to, but dude, like the Call of Duty 2 or Call of Duty 4 uh, tier 2 perks aren't very well balanced. Stopping power dominates. Uh, the perks in this game, like everyone is viable. And, and when you're talking about balance, you have to think about that. I did a video a long time ago talking about uh, weapon balance and how the LMGs are very well balanced in Black Ops 3. And when you're talking about weapon balance, you have to talk about every single weapon in the game. It's not just one field. Are the assault rifles and the SMGs good? Sweet, the game's really well balanced then. No, that's not how it works. Every single weapon has to be viable and every single weapon has to be usable. And I think that Black Ops 3 is the first Call of Duty where every single weapon is very viable. It, it does depend on the map, but that, that's kind of... That's just how things go. It, it will depend on the map, but for the most part, every single weapon in Black Ops 3 is a very useful weapon. The perks are great, balanced, and, and they've very much kept things up to date. They've patched things, they've made things better as they've gone along. The game, I mean, it's had its problems. We've talked about that in the previous episode in the bad. It, it's not without its problems. Any game will have its issues, and Black Ops 3 is no exceptions, but to me, the good very much outweighs the bad. So, some other reasons why I really enjoyed Black Ops 3, and again, this is kind of more of a, a personal thing, is because it really got me back into the franchise and it got me more invested into it. Now, I've mentioned this before in other videos that I kind of stopped playing Call of Duty for the last two iterations. I played some Ghosts, I put a little bit of hours into that, but as far as Advanced Warfare goes, I spent like three hours into that game. So. Really, I was kind of missing this part of my life that was, uh, I don't want to say so important, it's dumb, it's a video game, but uh, I don't know, it was a significant piece of my life, and I started watching YouTube videos again, and Black Ops 3 was so interesting that it got me invested into the game again, and I was like, you know what? We should try and do this, this YouTube thing again. I think I could do it. I think I would have some fun with it. So I decided to pick up a capture card recently, actually, and you know, but whatever. I, I had some, some means of recording before that. But uh, I, I decided it was time to invest and get back into the YouTube scene because I had a lot of fun doing it when I was doing it. It was uh, a little bit stressful at times and it did kind of, there was times where I wasn't enjoying it and that's actually why I left. But now that I'm back and I'm doing it, I'm really enjoying this. I like playing for gameplay. like. I, I'm not an amazing player, I'm not the best player in the world, but I'm decent and I can get some good gameplays as you guys have seen uh, throughout the course of the last, what, seven months that I've been back, whatever long or whatever uh, length I've been back, you guys have seen that I'm, I'm okay at the game and I can get some decent gameplays. And I like playing for that for some reason, I don't know why. 
it's fun playing for gameplays. Like I really enjoy doing that. So that's a big reason why Black Ops 3 is one of my favorite Call of Duties. Probably, actually it's my favorite Call of Duty. I did say that. I also said it's the best and I think that's kind of subjective. So maybe I'm being more opinionated in terms of it's my favorite and maybe not the best. But uh, no, no, I think it's the best actually. It's got such good balance. The maps that it shipped with were pretty damn good. I mean, there's a couple that are meh. It's not the best Call of Duty for maps. It's not the best Call of Duty for score streaks, but I do think it's the most balanced and that is pretty much the most important thing when you talk about a first person shooter and really a Call of Duty game. Because if, if something's really whack and out of balance, it lets the bad players be good and the good players um, or the bad player, yeah, the bad players be good and the good players are really good. And, and I think this particular game, if you don't have the skill, it, it shows. And I think that's really important and that's why I really enjoy this game. So, that's the final verdict, guys. That That's pretty much it. I think Call of Duty Black Ops 3 is the best Call of Duty of all time. I want you guys to let me know in the comments below. Maybe rank your Call of Duties. I, I might do that in a future video, like rank where each one... Uh, each one lives or whatever or where I where I would rank them um, I might do that in the future but let me know what you think of Black Ops 3 how does it rank compared to the other Call of Duties maybe you think I'm completely wrong and you think Black Ops 3 is a piece of garbage but uh, I really enjoyed my time on Black Ops 3 I, I thought it was a great game and I, I really enjoyed my time I'm still playing it to this day I don't know why <laughs> it's getting kind of bad there's there's not as many players playing it and there's some other games out that I really should be investing my time in but for some reason I'm still playing Black Ops 3 and that that shows like how much I enjoy it and how good that I think it is is that I'm still playing it to this time uh, this time frame where, where a lot of people aren't and uh, yeah that's pretty much it guys you let me know in the comments below like I said and that will do it for Black Ops 3 a year in review we finished the series today uh, let me know what you think of this series as well because maybe we'll do it for Infinite Warfare next year when it gets down to the bottom and the end of it. And uh, yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys in the comments below. Oh yeah, actually one more thing before I leave. I don't know what gameplay I have going on right now. So like I mentioned that in the beginning. So uh, I'm gonna leave now and if the gameplay is still going, I'm just gonna let you watch it because I don't know how much more Black Ops 3 I'm gonna upload. So enjoy it. I'll just let you watch the gameplay, listen to the beats and yeah, that's it. Peace guys. Fracture has moved. Be advised, hostile server is inbound. Hostile counter UAV above. Radar is down. Hostile UAV above. Advised, hostile UAV incoming. All CDP assets degraded. Your kids can compete.